Darnell Mooney uh, is currently going at the end of round six uh, at pick 72. I made mention that Allen Robinson came to Chicago and died. Um, so here I am talking about Mooney. He uh, is great friends with Justin Fields. They worked out all offseason together. He had a really nice catch in the preseason game, back shoulder throw, uh, right on the numbers. Even with the quarterback turmoil that was there last year on, on just a horrific offensive team, Darnell Mooney had the 11th most targets in football last year. And that's wide receiver two value at worst if you're going to finish with the 11th most targets. Like, he had three games with 13 or more targets. He only had one game with less than five targets, which was Fields' first game where the Bears essentially had negative yardage against the Browns. So, he's a guy, he had 81 catches, just over 1,000 yards, four touchdowns. Um, He ended up as wide receiver 24 last year. I have a hard time thinking he would finish worse than that. Um, So... A guy that we both like. We we root for him actively as Bears fans. But I think he's a wide receiver too. He kind of reminds me a lot of, of Brandon Cooks. He, he doesn't have the pedigree that Brandon Cooks did. But he's fast. He's a little on the smaller side. You don't think of him as like an elite wide receiver. But I think he's good. So end of round six value for a locked in wide receiver two is, is fine. Picks, you're 72 picks in. And you're getting a guy that we think is going to finish in the top 48, right? If you exclude quarterbacks, you exclude tight ends. Pick 72, we're expecting him to be in the top 48 from a positional standpoint. That's pretty good value. Yeah. um, I don't have a whole lot to add. I just think it's, you know, Darnell to the Mooney this season. Yikes. You didn't like that? Come on. I thought of that like... Two minutes ago. Well, I mean, it's better than the PP joke earlier, probably. <laughs> Not much better. Not much. Uh, no, I, I really do like Mooney. Uh, I'm I'm interested to see um, what is it gets and what he can do for uh, that offense coming over from Pittsburgh. He was the pass or not Pittsburgh Green Bay. He was the passing game quarterbacks coach in Green Bay. I think that he's going to have a nice little offense for the Bears. Uh, Hopefully fields can start progressing through his reads. Great, great point on the on the Packers offense, which obviously force fed the ball to Devontae Adams, who had, you know, he's basically averaged the most targets per game uh, over the last uh, two years. So if you're gonna if you're gonna give me a Devonte Adams uh, amount of targets, which would basically lock him in as a top five target guy after having the eleventh most last year, okay.